everybody, I'm Becca, welcome back. Today, we are going to be discussing the To All the Boys I Loved Before movie casting. If you don't know, which you should. To All the Boys I Loved Before by Jenny Han is a lovely trilogy about a girl named Lara Jean who writes love letters to the boys that she loved. One day she is absolutely mortified, trust me, I would be too, that all her letters has been sent out to all those boys. It's a hilarious book and if you haven't read it, you have to read it. I'm telling you now, this needs to be on your TBR and you need to read it. Back to the casting! When I learned that this book was already on its way to becoming a film, I about freaked out. I am so excited that this film is going to be a movie. Now let's get started and talk about the casting. Okay, alright. It's wrong direction. I've got my handy dandy computer here. Okay, so first I'm just gonna look up to all the boys I've loved before movie cast. To be honest, I have followed tons of to all the boys I love before accounts on Instagram just to keep up to date. So whenever the movie trailer hits on YouTube, I'm gonna be there. I'm gonna be there. So our main character, Lara Jean, is going to be played by Lena Lana. Condor. She looks exactly how I would imagine Lara Jean looking like. Lara Jean, she's half Korean and then half American. Yeah, this girl looks exactly what I would like imagine her to be. Her IMDB says she made her film debut in X-Men Apocalypse. I've never seen any of those movies. She was born May 11th, 1997 in Vietnam. Here's some pictures of her. Lara Jean is around 16 and 17 years old. I hate when movie casting people, they hire people that are way older than our main characters. Like, don't even get me started in the Percy Jackson franchise. They went wrong there in a lot of ways. But I love how she looks like she's around 16 and 17 years old. She fits the part well. I'm just, I've never seen her in movies before so I don't know how she's gonna play. So far so good our main character Lara Jean she fits the description in my head. Okay so who's gonna be playing Peter Kavinsky aka my bae? Noah Centineo. Centineo. Tineo. Okay okay he oh gosh another one that looks exactly how I would picture Peter Kavinsky. He looks like a jock and he's attractive, and he has that dark hair that Peter Kavinsky has. So a few things that he's been in, he's played Jesus in the show The Fosters, which I've never seen before. He was also nominated for a Teen Choice Award for playing that role, so that's a good sign. He was born May 9th, 1996 in Miami, Florida. He's been in The Gold Retrievers, How to Build a Better Boy, Growing Up and Down, and he's also been on the show Austin and Allie from Disney Channel. So I'm seeing a lot of Disney Channel and those kind of shows. Not sure how I feel about that. We shall see. I trust the casting people. No, I don't. But yes, I do. Because, I don't know. Oh my gosh, I'm on the fence. Insert pictures of Noah. He looks exactly how I would picture Peter Kavinsky being, but does he act like Peter Kavinsky? I don't know. These people are actors, so we have to trust them. But at the same time, we don't trust them. When you get our books and you make them into movies, you have to be very careful because this is a dangerous game. Fans of the books will go wild if one character doesn't even have the same hair color as a character in the book. AKA Annabeth Chase, Percy Jackson, and The Lightning Thief. I love the girl who is playing Margot. One little fact about me, I love the show Pretty Little Liars. I watched it religiously for like all the years it was on. Janelle Parrish, pictures here. She's an awesome actress. I trust her with that role. She's good, she's great. She was born 1988 in Honolulu, Hawaii. She's been acting for quite some time and I've seen the stuff that she's been in, especially Pretty Little Liars. She was on there for a really long time and she acted her role very good. So I trust her for playing Margot. One thing that's different is Pretty Little Liars, her character was very outgoing and like rebellious and like sneaky. Margot isn't like that. I think it's gonna be interesting how she takes on the role. And the person that is going to be playing our Josh, his name is Israel Brossard. Brossard. 
I'm not very good at names. He was born on August 22nd, 1994 in Mississippi. Okay, so he's cute. He's pretty attractive. I just always picture Josh be this blonde, the blonde guy from Vampire Diaries. I don't know, I forgot his name. Matt. Matt, right? That was his name, right? I picture him to be looking like this because Matt was friend zoned and that's exactly that's exactly Josh in To All the Boys I Love Before, definitely friend zoned. So I will always picture him like this. Hopefully he plays the part well of the friend zoned kid that will forever love Lara Jean but will never have her because Peter Kaminsky always wins. Who's gonna be playing Kitty? Oh, I've seen this girl. Anna Cathcart. She's a Canadian actress. She was born in 2003. She's been in things called Odd Squad, Dino Dan, Descendants 2, Once Upon a Time, and To All the Boys. Oh, wait. That's now. This movie has me so pumped. I feel like it's going to be so funny, yet so cute and just sweet and just gushy. And Peter Gravinsky, oh my gosh, I'm so ready. And like I said before, I followed so many of the To All The Boys I Love Before movie Instagram pages and they post like tons of videos and like pictures. They look like our characters, guys. The movie is being produced by Awesomeness Films and Overbrook Entertainment. So are you guys like nervous about this or are you more excited about it? I'm more excited about it. I am pumped to see this movie. I cannot wait till the movie trailer is gonna come out. We'll talk about that when it happens. I have a really good feeling about this. I don't know how they can get this wrong. It's gonna be such a funny movie, I feel like. Could you, could you just imagine having all your love letters sent out to all the boys that you wrote them to? No, because it's a nightmare. But I am so excited to see this movie. I hope you guys are too. Make sure to leave comments down below what you thought about the cast. Are you excited about the cast? Do you like everyone that was casted? When do you guys think the movie trailer is going to be released? Because I'm pretty sure they've already done all the filming. So guys, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And follow all my social medias. I will see you in my next video. Bye.